Hello guys, Peaches here and this is going to be the first video on the channel making a 3D print and the printing question is a bracket for my camera cage this is my main camera I like to use for most of my camera work on videos and it's a Nikon P510 with a modified cage to fit my camera the problem with this cage is when I want to mount the viewfinder piece on you can see it is uncentral which means it doesn't line up with the screen on the back and if you don't know this type of camera you can essentially do that with a screen but because it doesn't line up it's not in frame properly so we're going to be developing a bracket to fit here which will fix that problem so as you can see this is the bracket in Tinkercad these grey parts that have the lines on these are for indentations and holes these do not show up in the 3D model so you can see I've got indents for the bolts on either side and the holes for the bolts and then we've got this larger bit of sticks out which has the hole all the way through for the viewfinder and that is central in the centre of the camera so the idea of this bracket is you screw it to the frame there and then you screw the viewfinder bracket screw on here and it's central so I have already sliced it in the Cruella Tality slicer you can see here's a model so we've got these indents here for the bolts the holes for the bolts and the end hole for the bolt for the viewfinder so let's 3d print this part and once it's 3d printed let's test fit it on the camera cage
So, we have finished mounting the bracket. As you can see, I've got two standard bolts with D rings mounted to the frame and a central bolt that holds this viewfinder piece on. But because it's now all lined up, you can see in the viewfinder, I can now see what the camera is seeing on the screen. So that means when I'm filming videos and I have a camera out like this, I can see what the camera's seen through the viewfinder because it's all lined up. Which means it's going to be very useful for, for example, if you're doing a video like this, a vlog video, you're going to be able to see yourself quite easily. Or if you're doing a video for you in a costume that has limited visibility, you can do that and you'll see yourself in costume quite easily through the viewfinder while the camera's recording. So I hope you guys enjoyed this bracket video. Let me know if you want any more 3D print videos on the channel. But I find them quite fun to do and I think it'd be fun to start doing more 3D stuff on my channel. So camera brackets, little figures, that kind of stuff, little projects. It'd be fun to do. I'll have this bracket linked in the description down below so that if you've got the same type of camera cage it'll be compatible this camera cage is an andoa camera cage so if you've got a similar camera cage it should be compatible but not every camera cage will be the same but it will also all camera cages have the same mounting holes so either way you should be able to mount one but not all of them are the same. Some might have larger holes, some might have smaller holes. So that depends on the camera cage. Fortunately, I've made the holes on this bracket wide enough that even if you use smaller screws, it should hold on as long as it has quite a wide head on the top. But I'll have it linked in the description. So if you want to download it to use it on your camera, you can. So this is Peaches signing out.